remember being young once. A time so long ago, it's hard to believe this is who I've become. Why do things get so complicated? I remember being so excited about start starting my, my new life, life on, on the West Coast. Coast. California, I mean, who wouldn't want to live where it's sunny all the time? I'd just seen this cool, sexy, relaxed life in the movies, and I knew that I wanted to experience that for myself. A bigger life. Leaving home at such a young age, there was no sense of responsibility or reality. It's a lot easier to believe you can do anything when your whole life is ahead of you. There was so much time, and time favors the young. My friends and I took a car from a small town in Virginia out to Hollywood. I told them things I'd never told anyone before. With what felt like endless hours to kill, we just sort of plotted out our lives. I'm, I'm gonna, gonna be, be an, an actress. actress. To be an actress. <laughs> How unlikely of a possibility was that to happen? But I was so wild and free. Invincible. Invincible. There was no logic back then. Now, maybe I have too much. I think I finally found my calling, my reason. I was so unsure of who I was back then, but things are finally clicking together. This is who I want to be. Life never turns out how you imagine it to. It's my life to live, and no one can tell me who I should or shouldn't be. I don't know anything to anybody, not to my parents and not to the world. How selfish. I'm not trying to be a bad daughter but I can't live to please them and then regret it. And they do want what's best for me, right? Clarity only comes after, in hindsight. I can see now, with a daughter of my own, how terrible it must have been for them. You have a child and you want everything for them, and you hope that they'll be there for you when you're old. Parents have to be parents, but kids have to be kids. There's this age-old saying, it's something like, you must kill thy father to live. Clear out the old, make room for the new. That's just the cycle of life. Who could dispute that? I gave those years the best I had. And maybe it wasn't good enough, but what else could I have done? Call it fate if you want, but with what I knew and how I felt, I couldn't have done it any other way. I know one day I'll be old and wrinkly. And I just hope that old me looks back and says, good job. The only thing to rattle around in this old brain now is memories. Memories of what had been. And the pressure of what could be. This is who I am today. I'm neither old nor young anymore. I gave acting a damn good run, but now my own daughter's on the way. I still have dreams but a little more wisdom too. The rest of my life is still up to me.